Greetings, this is Earthman Origami's Living Soil, alive and thankful to be alive by the Creator, God. He is good all the time, every day, to you and to me. A little uh, follow-up report on my uh, uh, giant primrose. I've already cut two of the flowers off to give to my wife. She loves fresh-cut flowers, but they are looking, the plant's looking pretty big, and and. The thing I wanted to describe here or tell you in this video is it's good to have a couple of these center of your garden. A big, couple big primrose sunflowers. Not the mammoths, even though they're real nice. Um, these primrose really bring in the bees. And uh, while they're here, well, they might as well pollinate your tomato plants or your pepper plants or your cucumber plants. So uh, a giant primrose flower is a good... Uh, way to draw in pollinators. That's what I'm kind of shooting at with this video. Um, and, and you know, the corn, like I said, it's doing really good. These are the ones right here that are in the bed. And I got a couple more down there. But the ones that are um, in uh, five gallon containers are doing really well. They're looking really healthy, as you can see. And um, I have a couple other primrose sunflowers that are coming up. Um, and I got one right over there. Um, I think this one's probably about, see I'm six foot tall, or actually five ten. I wish I was six foot. I guess no, I'm glad. God made me this tall. That's cool. Uh, but this one is uh, probably about five feet, about as tall as me, I would say, if I was to get up on the hill, maybe a little bit bigger. I would say six feet tall, this giant primrose is, and it's very healthy. The leaves are looking really good, really big, big, big leaves. I got bigger ones over there and stuff. So, but once again, uh, pollinators. Uh, some other good pollinators are these cosmos. They really draw in the bees here. And uh, I got some miracles coming up. This miracle plant's looking pretty big. But you want pollinators in your garden. Uh, I have some marigolds over here. I'll show you those real quick. So, yep. Uh, this is a looking good, looking good garden. My tomato plants are getting really long. I think uh, they're stretching a lot because uh, there's not as much sun over here as there is in this area right here. We're looking to cut, take down some trees here and make some room. Once again, you want pollinators in your garden and one great pollinator to put in your garden is the giant primrose. This is Earth Man from Origami's Living Soil. And may God bless you. And I really mean that.